Hey my goatee gang, I am here for another food review. This one is kind of like a collab, not really, it's more of a shout out to Ashley Pino Jalapeno. She did a review of these Del Monte Veggie Fool uh, Hot Pockets, they're called Pocket Pies. She did the review shortly after I did my Hot Pocket video and she did a shout out to me because I did the Hot Pockets and these are kind of like Hot Pockets. So I'm reviewing all four of the varieties that Del Monte makes. They've got the rosemary garlic plant-based chicken with mushrooms and spinach. They got the broccoli potato cheddar. They got the spinach artichoke parmesan and they have the plant-based Philly cheesesteak with bell peppers and onions. I'm super excited for them all. I baked them um, in my toaster oven, but I did it under convection. I think I have the right order. I think I've got the rosemary garlic, broccoli potato cheddar here. I've got the spinach, artichoke, parmesan, and the Philly cheesesteak. We'll see what I think of them. They've been on my list to review for a couple months now, I'm thinking. Without further ado, I've got my four hot pockets and a coffee here. Let's see what um, the um, rosemary garlic plant-based chicken tastes like. Here we go. I'm glad I baked them. They came out perfect. Look at this. really good for being plant-based chicken that is really good I like that spinach I really you taste the spinach a lot mm. it's almost like a cream of mushroom soup base on the inside and they came out awesome in the oven they really did the goat definitely recommends this rosemary garlic that was awesome let's move on to the broccoli potato cheddar cleansing my palate Only one of them really bust busted out. I think her spinach artichoke also blew out. I did see on the side of the box it says the crust is made out of cauliflower. Now I'm getting into some of the cheese. really good man that is hard to say which one I like more like pieces of potato actually in there normally it's like broccoli cheddar you don't normally get potato thrown into that mix but it's really good almost reminds me of like a pierogi Broccoli cheddar pierogi. That broccoli just, it, the flavor bursts out. I highly recommend that one as well. I, I don't know which one I liked more. I think this one. I think rosemary garlic still slightly above the broccoli potato cheddar. I think it could use a little more cheese. That might be what's missing. Let's see what this uh, spinach artichoke parmesan is like. I go to a pizza buffet called Infinitos and they have a spinach artichoke pizza and it is so good. I'm hoping this has the same kind of like flavor as that because that is good. All right, spinach artichoke parmesan. Mmm, 
I am a huge fan of spinach. When I was a kid, you, you hear spinach and it just turned you off. I remember just it turning me off. It is so good. It's, I think it's one of my favorite vegetables. But, literally, I love it. It is so good. All right, I'll try to get a good, good view of this one for you. I don't have a lot of light back here. That one is really good. The only thing I noticed with this one is compared to the others, actually, <clears throat> the rosemary garlic was the most full. Then the broccoli cheddar, and then this one. It just seems like there's not as much filling. Maybe because spinach is more just a leaf than doesn't take as much space up but the, the parmesan sauce in there is really good that one might get knocked up to first place spinach artichoke rosemary garlic broccoli potato cheddar I think that's my that's my recommended uh, how good they are all right last one the plant-based Philly cheesesteak Let's see how this is. I'm very curious on this one. Mmm. The flavor in that is really good. Definitely taste those peppers and onions. Very good. I like that that cheesy steak taste too. It's nice that they can pull that off without using actual meat. Hmm. What am I gonna rate that in order? how good they are I would go <clears throat> spinach artichoke then the rosemary garlic that just had such a good filling in it it was like like I said it was like a mushroom soup almost so good so let's do it this way number one number two I'm gonna go Philly cheesesteak. That one was pretty darn good. That's my order. My most favorite flavor to my least favorite. They're all awesome. I highly recommend you go out and trying to get these. They're not widely available. I had to get them at my local shop right. If you grab them, definitely look for that spinach artichoke parmesan. That is my favorite. Everyone has their own taste buds, but <clears throat> I think I give a, a good honest review. So thanks to Del Monte for creating some all-natural, plant-based, hot pocket alternatives. Um, maybe I'll do a challenge on these sometime. Maybe not, since they're a little pricey. If they ever come out with bigger boxes, more than two pockets, I'll debate it. So thanks for tuning in to another review. And um, thanks for your continued support. Don't forget to subscribe and like. And thanks to Ashley Pino Jalapeno for reviewing these and tagging me in her video. And uh, this is a shout out to her. So go watch her video. I'll have a link in the description. And until the next video, the goat is out. If you're watching Del Monte, make a family box and get more widely distributed. Maybe Walmart. Um, oh crap, hold on.